Yo, what's going on everybody? It's your boy Apoc King Carter here. I want to welcome you guys to a new NBA 2K21 video. So right now on screen, I got a build for y'all. Now, of course, patch 1.03 is out right now. NBA 2K the company is calling it patch 2. The community is calling it patch 3. We don't know what the hell is going on, but all I can tell you is that the offensive threat or I would say the scoring machine or however you want to look at the build, the build that uses slashing and shooting as its main factors of the pie, which means you'll have Hall of Fame shooting badges and Hall of Fame slashing badges is back. Now, look, the reason why I say that is back. NBA 2K has decided to give every BP build that had the amazing uh, attributes and, and style points and everything that it had in NBA 2K20 some love on NBA 2K21. So on screen, you are currently looking at a build with slashing and shooting physical pie. It has the most acceleration and speed physical pie. And I could tell you right now, with the way the badge points are looking, I haven't even touched my wingspan, haven't even touched my weight, haven't even touched my height. I have 14 finishing, 18 shooting, 12 playmaking, and seven defensive badges. Now, I will not call this the most complete, diverse, all around build, but God damn it, on paper, this build looked crazy. Only simply because in patch three, you now can get pro dribble moves at an 80 ball handle. So let me let you guys understand this. Imagine a 6'5 built minimum weight, maximum wingspan build out there just tearing up the place. Now, the reason why I say this build needs to have built max wingspan, minimum weight. If you guys look at the attributes, we're not even talking about badges no more because I've moved on from that. You know what I'm saying? 14, 18, 12, and 7. Need I remind you? This build will have a 81 three-pointer. Uh 81 ball handle a 85 driving dunk need i remind you there's certain things in this game that require certain attributes and what 2k just did may have broke the game imagine curry sliding behind screens with this build and coming out of that curry slide with a, a way to get to the rim and finish at the rim or stop and pop or move and fade. Now, let me let you understand something. If you want to create this build, all you got to do is watch what I'm doing because this is everything that everybody's going to be doing real, real soon. Now, of course, with this build, I may be one of the only people to make it this way. A lot of people really aren't worried about driving dunk, even though they should be, because I feel like driving dunk is what makes your player much more versatile. And <laughs> I'm not going to lie to y'all, man. I have a play shot. I have a two-way slash and playmaker. But if I make this build... I may have to reveal to y'all that this may be my favorite build. Now, another thing y'all have to understand, I'm not going to be the primary ball handler in this situation if I take this build anywhere. If I take this build to the park, I'm going to be the number two. So, of course, my number one will have Hall of Fame Floor General, which will only boost my stats even more. So when you think about it, this build is made for either corner sitting, wrapping, whatever you want it to be. Or if you want to take this build to twos and curry slide all day, 
that's also an option because yes this build does have dimer if you need it it will have alley passer if needed we'll have quick first step we'll have handles for day it has 12 playmaking badges so if you really need to finesse some way quick first step handles for days tight handles ankle breaker if it works you know what i mean bail out you know it, space creator it has options this is a very very good build now i know y'all probably waiting on trying to figure out what the name of this build is and of course you see here you don't get a three point takeover now i know you guys are probably like well wait 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 this ain't really this ain't that why won't i get a three point takeover remember if you had the slash and takeover in 2k20 all of your attributes everything around the board your speed your 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 acceleration your three-point shot your mid-range everything got upgraded same stands here so i will be getting the slashing takeover with this build and you have built a slasher when people see this build come to the park they won't test it they won't step out on it they're gonna be like oh that bill can't shoot that bill can't shoot why why am i why am i why am i going next to that bill why am i why am i even trying to guard that bill i, I know i'm gonna help on defense i'm gonna sit paint you sit paint with my 18 shooting badges my dude got hall of fame floor general and i'm gonna i would say 98 overall and 98 overall this build is crazy because remember we talking about your ball handle your three-point shot your driving dunk 98 overall this build crazy but at 99 in which we already know you can keep a 99 overall with no problem this year keeping a 99 overall is not hard at all so think 85 driving dunk 81 three-pointer 81 ball handle and your homie got floor general and you can go get gym rat with this build real quick by playing a couple of my career game play like 50 my career games which is is enough to grind all your badges for this build which shouldn't take you that long maybe a few days come on to the park with this build gym rat it fully finished and if you already got gym rat because you already hit superstar too then damn it make this build because i'm telling you you're going to see a lot of this build around. I'm telling you, this is going to be a sleeper build. A lot of people going to sleep on it, of course. But I'm telling y'all, this build right here is crazy. All right. Listen, man. Patch 3. That's what I'm calling it. Patch 103 for all those technical guys is out right now. And people are creating this build or a variation of this build because they want to bring back the offensive threat in the scoring machines but i'm telling you now what i just made it's a new name in the game and that's called slasher and i'm gonna see you on the next video man peace